And you? What what language do you dream in? Uh, Welcome everybody to Ask Tetsu, where I share information about how we raise our four children in five languages. So I've been getting questions from you guys on my videos, uh, especially one on, on this interview that I did with the kids uh, last time. So I figured I'll follow up on that today. So we have Joey306. <coughs> so we have Joey306 who, who has been asking you guys questions, okay? Here's the first one. So, nice video. I really liked it. I have a question for Ronnie and Nika. Are there any other languages you'd like to learn in the future? So, what are the five languages that you speak? Chinese traditional, Spanish, uh, Japanese, French, English. Good. So, are there any other languages you would like to learn? Do you know any other languages? German. German? You would like to learn German? No. <laughs> Actually, I should I should note that Joey306 says greetings from Germany. So he is German. <laughs> Whoops. Would you like to learn German? Yes, yes, yes. Um, <laughs> yes from Nika. A little. <laughs> okay, a little. Yeah, well daddy did learn German when he was younger, but uh, it's a very hard language. <laughs> okay. <laughs> that was an imitation of of German. No, no. I know no, one. I, don't. I know one very hard word. What? Bacharach. Bacharach. <laughs> <laughs> it's a place. It's a place in Germany. Bacharach. Yes. Okay. All right. So no other languages you would like oh. to learn. Let's go to Joey's next question. Joey asks. Which is your favorite language? I think we covered this a little bit in our previous English. video. English! English? It's your favorite language? Uh, is it the e easiest language or the one that you love the most? Uh, it's Japanese, I think. Oh, no, no, no. French, French. <laughs> Which one? French! French? Why? Because I love... Um, I love reading books on... Oh, because you love reading books in French. Oh, I see. That's a good reason. Finally, this is going to be fun. In which language do you think and dream? So, when you think to yourself, uh, I don't when you talk to yourself, what is the language that you use? Depends on the place. Depends on the place? Uh, so, if you're in Japan, you think in Japanese? If you're in Quebec, you think in? French? Oh. English? English. Really? You think in English? Oh, that's a, that's a surprise. Okay. I don't know. You don't know. I think it's Japanese. You think it's Japanese? Okay. Well, that's fair enough. I guess that means uh, they're ja at least we know that their Japanese is very strong, if not the strongest language. Uh, and also English. And uh, I, I would like to note that they don't have formal education in English in any way. So, uh, by, by formal, I mean we don't have a very strong strategy. It's mostly just watching TV and the occasional coaches uh, and, and friends who speak English. So, it's, uh, it is surprising that they, that they like English so much. So, uh, finally, uh, this part two of this question is what language do you dream in? When you, when you have a dream, who, you know, what language are you speaking in that dream? Depends on who I am speaking to in my dream. Oh wow! Okay, that's my it. Mommy. If you speak with mommy, it's in Japanese. It's in Japanese. And you? What what language do you dream in? Uh, Two hours later. In the dream is Japanese too. It's in Japanese. Mostly in Japanese. Because the. What if Clara comes in the dream? Does she, does, she, does she speak Japanese with you? No. Then if she speaks French with you, do you I speak? didn't see in the dream. Oh, you. Yeah, but I what if? What if? Them. Example. Uh, what if Clara? French. It would be French. French because she, she speaks French. Okay. Well, there you go. 
Joey, thank you, thank you for your questions. And I would invite all the viewers to uh, add more questions to, to this video or to our other previous videos. I'll try to pick some up and uh, do this type of uh, spontaneous in interviews and see what the kids say. All right. Now, if you're interested in, in these types of uh, interviews, I could link up the previous one right there in that corner. And if you are interested in other concepts and strategies in, multi in raising multilingual children, uh, please check out this playlist right below this window. <laughs> and I'll see you in the next video. I'll see you!